What's good, Patreons? It's your boy Carcino here. Let's get to it. Ah, oh, man. This y'all early premiere. So y'all get this. I don't know when the YouTubers will see it, the regular ones, but this is why you guys get all the exclusive. And boy, <laughs> this <laughs> explains a lot. Um, a lot of people in Seattle know or have heard about the story. Um, Russell Wilson and his wife Ashton. And everybody's like, what happened, man? Why did Russ just up and, you know, get out of there so quick? Like, why he divorced his wife? You know, like, what What happened? Everything happened so fast. And him and Golden Tate, you know, this, this split up the championship team. Everybody talks about the Legion of Boom, but they never talk about the actual offense splitting up. And this was the pinnacle of what was going on with the team. Now, leading up to the Super Bowl, or before the Super Bowl period, during this season, Russell Wilson is becoming one of the NFL's most top-watched personalities. Black quarterback, and all this was happening, right? Now, during the same time, Russ is on the team. He's very tight with Golden Tate, his wide receiver. They're closer than anybody else on the team. Now, the reason that these two are so close is because Golden Tate and his fiance at the time, they are, you know, like best friends. His wife didn't have too many people that she communicated with, trusted, or spoke to in those situations, and his wife was one of them. Or his Felice, I mean, fiance, I think her name is Elise. But, um, they were very connected in that way. Like that was her girlfriend. And now, it's all of these things that happen fast. They got married fast. They were high school sweethearts and went to different colleges and she ended up transferring following his dreams to support him as they became more exclusive. And he proposed right before he got drafted and then was married shortly after. I mean, before they actually got drafted, he got married. So basically, 300 people attended a shotgun wedding. And after they attended the shotgun wedding, you know, it was kind of, I want to say, you know, like out of the blue or out of the ordinary that someone gets married that quick right before they're getting drafted. But they do. And once the marriage takes place, he signed a contract for about $3 million or whatever. 
very small initial opening contract. Now, Aston is not somebody who's career driven. Like, she was wanting to do her own work. Um, she's uh, somebody who was an insurance salesman and she wanted to do that in her life and, you know, working. You know, and inspire to do other things, but she, uh, during this time, was about the family and everything else, and the marriage and everything where it brings. Now, Golden Tate, his wife, is a little bit different. They're the ones who, you know, go out and seem to party and fraternize. And her friends are all back in Virginia, you know, where she grew up. You know, they don't have too many, like, athletes or women that's, you know, that goes out to these nightclubs. And, and that's kind of how Golden White... Tate's uh, fiance was, and she got along right along well with them. They were like besties, so they were really close. And Russ didn't trust too many people around his wife, but but um, this is one player he did. Golden Tate. Now, Golden Tate and his wife was out there. Um, Partying and you know doing what they do, and a rumor was started that I don't know where it came from and who started it and how it got started, but but many people believe that somebody blogged it that Golden Tate was the reason when the divorce was announced, and it was because of Golden Tate. And he was with the wife and had slept with his wife and that caused all this. And the sports media world just picked up and ran with it. The sports media world picked up and ran with that fact. That notion. How weird is that? You know, um, normally when someone pick up something like that, uh, like it's factual or true, this was, I'm here to tell you right now, from what I know, it's not true. Golden Tate did not sleep with Russell Wilson's wife at the time, his wife, and didn't sleep with her at all. Um, the reason why Golden Tate left the team was monetary reasons. They were not going to match what Detroit had offered him. So when he left after they won the Super Bowl, that was that. Percy Harvin and Golden Tate got into a shoving match because Percy Harvin played too much and he was a bit of a troublemaker on the team. Everybody knew that. Percy Harvin was that kind of guy. He was confrontational with a lot of people on the team. Him and Golden Tate had some words during a practice. This was during the playoffs. And it got resolved by one of the captains of the team. So it wasn't a big situation. People made that out to be a situation. 
and the rumor had tied into it that Percy Harvin had punched uh, Golden Tate in the face because he found out that he was sleeping with the wife and all. people created that nonsense. They had an on the field issue with temper and Percy Harvin has gotten into it with a lot of teammates, coaches. It, he was a problem. So Percy Harvin that year was moved to the Jets. <laughs> and Golden Tate decided to go to another team. That's how that wasn't. So this wasn't that they didn't want Golden Tate in Seattle. That was not the case. Russ never made that the point. So he ended up going to the Detroit at the time. Now, with this whole situation and how it's playing out, people want to know the reason for the divorce. There were problems in the marriage right away. They got married too quick before ex even experiencing what this was going to be in an NFL world and being an NFL wife and him being a husband surrounded in the NFL. Now, Russ was starting to have a conflict of interest on what he wanted and what she wanted. He wanted to right away start a family, have a bunch of kids. She wasn't about being a house mom at the time. He wants housewife. And, all right, it's time for you to start having kids. We're two years in. Let's start this family, kids, the whole nine. That's what he wanted. Kids, family, let's go. She wasn't really into that right off the bat. She wanted to kind of give it some time. Give her about a year or two. And then we could start talking about kids, you know, and being at home and all these things. But there's arguments, there's huge fights. But it's mostly coming from Russ and not her. And then quickly. We always blame the wife or the woman. She must have done something to cause the superstar Russell Wilson to want to leave when Russ wanted to leave her. He wanted to separate and get out into the field. It was Russ who was out there searching for another woman. It was Russell Wilson who was doing all of this. And immediately after he files for divorce, he began immediately dating Sierra. Immediately. It just wasn't made public. But that's what he wanted. She played her mark and got her mark. They had the same ambitions, same type of goals.
And that was her opportunity. And she played him like a fiddle. She made him wait until they got married before having sex. Saying, we won't do sex until we get married. But we will date and everything. So Russ had to sustain and go through abstinence. Rushed this marriage. Two years later, they are married. And right away, she was pregnant within the first three months or four months of marriage or whatever. And Russ was the instant father to future son. Which led to a big fallout and then how it went down. Then she was like, well, I want you guys to meet each other. But by then, it was so much damage done. Like, Future is like, we could have done this the right way. But you chose to do it the way you did it. And it was sneaky and dirty. But what you guys don't realize, Patreons and many YouTubers down the road, is that most of these women are programmed. And they are basically put on a track to date men with power or men with who are successful. They're trained how to do it. Sierra was one. She was always trained how to be with somebody who's successful and get what we want out of it. That has been their whole careers. Trained to be kept. It's a lot of them. Gabrielle Union. Sanai Lathan. Um, how many I'm missing? Ashante. Uh, we'll go into this later. It's a whole, it's a whole list of these women. And they're out there. But you'll wonder why and how they get with these powerful men and what's going on. But we'll see. Well, many people will see when it's just said and done. Now, what about Russ's ex-wife? Well, she got $4 million in the divorce. Because at that time, Russ did not sign his crazy contract yet. So the divorce was filed before he signed the massive contract. So, while filing for the divorce, she ended up getting $4 million, around $4 million out of the divorce. So, I mean... I wouldn't say it's bad for her. She's back in her insurance business. Uh, Golden Tate and Russ are not friends. Um, it has nothing to do with him cheating with the wife. But he doesn't want anything to do with Golden because Golden communicates and still hangs out with his ex-wife. And that's why he chooses to really not have anything to do with it. Uh, his ex-wife, she's moved on. 
she's doing her thing and she's selling real like um, not real estate but life insurance I believe so that's where she's doing that's where she went to school for and being insurance salesman home and auto and all that stuff so she's made all her accounts private so For the guy who asked me for this and paid very handsomely and donations asking for it, I appreciate it, you know, but there was nothing to really report on this. Um, this was uh, nothing but a rumor, mostly, about those two. And it ruined the career of Tate because, and he was more mad at Russ than anything because Russell Wilson never came to his aid. Knowing that it wasn't true, you know, you never came out and said, hey, that's not true what they're saying about my teammate Golden. And he's like, man, Russ, you know, I'm just kind of disappointed that he hadn't come out and tell the world that it wasn't true. Why is he letting that rumor go around? And the reason why Russ was letting it go around is because Golden Tate and, and his fiance, now his wife, I believe, and it was his fiance at the time. Uh, they think they're married now, but at the time, um, his wife was still friends with her. So Golden's always around his ex wife and everything. and you know, Russ isn't trying to have that dynamic around his new wife. So that's why, and plus they're not teammates anymore, so they really don't speak. But when they were on team, they were very close. So that's that. Now you know the truth. I'm sorry, there's no sparkling cheating rumor. But the only person that may have cheated was Russ. As far as dating someone and trying to get out of a marriage he was in because he's ready to start a relationship with somebody else. It would be Russ and not her. So now that we have that addressed, thank you for your time. Subscribe to the page. Hit the notification bell and for the Patreons. This is why you always are first. And we'll holler later on.